Hello everyone, and welcome back to Pokemon Wait. I am Fuzzwuzz. Last time we came here to the town with a lullaby for trains, and this time we'll finally be heading back to Drift Vale City and heading to the cold storage. After we clear that out, we'll be allowed to take on the gym, and Team PETA is in the cold storage, and they're doing a whole bunch of shenanigans, so we gotta deal with that. And did it just the shenanigans? I never say that. That's an achievement for me. Alright, here at Driftvale, and, um, I just found out, in every date, uh, in every, um, month where it's autumn, at the 20th day of the month, or higher, it's going to be rainy and foggy, and that's what I showed you right there. So, yeah. And, uh, yeah, about that, it's been introduced in the ice path, or ice cave, it's the ice path, um, the sliding floors, or... Yeah, now it's back over here at black and white also. It's been in other generations also, but, you know, I just, uh, had to mention that. Wait, has it been in the fourth generation, the ice puzzles? Um, don't remember. My bad. Uh, whatever. Actually, no, it's not. Yeah, I don't think it's been present in the fourth generation, the ice puzzles where if you walk, you slide all the way. In the third generation, I think it was, so yeah. Um, but I be do believe it was a bit different. Oh, a Pantsier! Okay. If I see another monkey, then I'll rage, but whatever. Not too sure, actually. Oh, snap! Ooh, Saito! Oh, I forgot that's a special move. Or at least it looks like one. Psy Shock for the win. But yeah, there have been numerous ice puzzles, ones that crack once you step on them, and ones that let you, or make you slide all the way across the other side. And, uh, yeah. Actually, it has been present in the fourth generation, if you want to, um, include heart gold and soul silver into the mix. Mm-hmm. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, yes, it has been in the fourth generation, in the snow point gym. Forgot about that completely. Okay, and, uh, Timber, and a Pantsier, I think. Just got sidetracked a bit. Ooh, look at that guy. I like that V a lot. What's up, buddy? Anyway, heading up here, and seems up, seems as if we've got another trainer battle. Warm up with the trainer battle. And, uh, yeah, there are not too many trainers over here, so I'll show every other trainer, so, or every trainer. And freaking monkeys! Another monkey. I'm telling you, this guy's probably gonna have a timber. I think? And after that, he's going to have another trainer will probably have a uh, pan sage and a timber. Another one just to, um, go with the trend, and, you know, they have to represent every monk in the game. Alright, Timber. Same story, go Psyshock, Rock Throw. That may be the end fall for me, if there's another t another Timber later on. Hopefully, um, hopefully Saito can do well, because I want Saito to get a lot of levels. I want, uh, her to be near level 30 by the end of this place. And, um, I gotta say, I really like this, uh, cold storage place. Like, with all the, um, fog, not fog, the, what do you call it? The mist going around, and, I don't know, it, it's really cool, and the music just adds to it. And, oh, I made it! So good, I'm so good at this game. And there's the guy we saw way back, who, uh, looked all cool up on this place. My heart is burning. Okay. And everybody's talking about being warm and being cold, because they are in the cold storage, but they want to be hot, but they are not hot. They're they're cold, and I don't know. What am I trying to say? Low kick. Oh, are, are you serious? Low kick? I figure you'd have a rock throw, but hey, whatever. I'll take your yeah, stupidity. Or if you don't, if you do not have a rock throw, then whatever. Like, girder. Girder. Surprised right there that it... He did not have... Ooh, Endeavor. Endeavor is a move which, um, brings down the po the HP of a Pokemon to the one that the user has. Like, say, Saito has, like, one HP, then it'll be doing a lot of damage to the other Pokemon until it has one HP. So it's always like that. But, no, I will not be teaching Endeavor because, I don't know, I don't even know what kind of, uh, move my hidden power is for Saito. And I'd rather use that, because, who knows, it might be a really good hidden power, and, um... I'd rather not only have, uh, special... 
psychic moves. And Endeavor, there are not a lot of occasions that... Let's see if we can skip this guy. Oh! Oh, freaking ninja! Anyways, I was saying, let's see... Oh, or what was I saying again? Um, wait, first of all, how many Pokemon do you have? Two! Pants Age! Aw, oh, Vanillite! Dang it, so close. But as I was saying, um, yeah, there are not too many instances where Endeavor actually plays out well. And by the way, Vanillite, you can actually capture that near the cold storage, because, yeah, I did not mention that yet, my bad. But, uh, yeah, Vanillite, a lot of people hate that thing. It evolves into two ice creams and then uh, three ice creams, if I'm not mistaken. Wait a minute. Is it three ice creams? Um, Vanillite. I don't know, but it's an ice cream Pokemon, as you can tell. It's really... A lot of people don't like it, but I actually do a lot, because the concept has not not been used yet, and, you know, whatever concept they can Game Freak can use, I'm okay with that, so... Yeah, and it's not like it's not any creative at all, because, um... Pokemon that are not creative are Pokemon like Voltorb and Electrode. This is creative enough, it's complex enough to be accepted by me. So yeah, um, I'm not sure if it's three ice creams or one or two. I think Vanillite evolves into a bigger ice cream and then it becomes two ice creams. I don't remember it being three. Um, now making it across. Hyper Potion, sweet. And cool guy posing up on top. And these people are ninjas, they spot me. Ready to battle? Sure. And these guys are shivering and stuff. Okay. A timber. Okay, seems as if they, they do not have a pants age. My bad for judging you. I'm sorry, I just don't like those monkeys. And I don't know. If I don't like them, why am I trying to find them? I guess they're, they're like attached to my brain. Like, I have to spot them. If I don't in one episode, then I rage and whatever. Another Vanillite and Rock-type moves are super effective to Ice-type Pokémon, so... The engine power ought to do the trick, and... Yep. That's, uh, awesome. A Timber. Man, uh... Terex is has gone to the point where he's way overpowered, because none of these Pokémon really stand a chance against Terex to do any considerable amount of damage, um... to, uh, for, to make Defeatus kick in, so... I'm sh shivering. I'm so cold that I'm shivering. SpongeBob quote. I did not recreate that too well. Or act that out too well. My bad. Hey, it's my uh, best friend. No, I don't know. Then I guess people are in here. Who knows? And no items remaining. Heading in. And it's Team PETA. Waiting. Let's see what's going on. Zenzo, oh, that's one kick-ass name. All of you huddle around me, I can't take this cold. Ah, Muffin. I feel sorry for you. Yeah, 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 get out of here, man. Intruders. Hypocrites! You guys are a whole bunch of intruders, too. And that's a bad formation. That's not even evened out. Come on, Game Freak. Ah, whatever, it makes sense, because then I would not be able to battle the, po the trainer at the one side, because it'd be trapped by two other sprites, and yeah. Whatever. Watchug. And I guess we just gotta battle these Team Plasma Grunts over and over again. Hopefully by the end of this, uh, Terex becomes level 32, just like Solid, and just like Sammy. Um, 31. Alright. Dragon Breath. Yeah, I'm definitely teaching this to uh, Terex. 60 power, has a transfer paralysis, a dragon type move. I'll get rid of. Uh, what's that move called? Quick Guard. Never really used it anyway, and don't even know how to use it. Scraggy. And keep on using acrobatics. Really a, an overpowered move, but hey, I'm not gonna complain. 110, added in with Stab, and added in with Terex's amazing attack. Long live Team Plasma! And. Just got interrupted by that, whatever. Another trainer. And let's see what this guy's got in store. Oh, it's a female. I can't even tell. It's hard to tell. Shrubbish. 
You're a whole bunch of trash, or whatever. Whole bunch of trash. Whole bag of trash. Or, or, I'm gonna take out the trash, and you're gonna disappear right now, because I'll take you out. There we go. Um. Yes, yes, you are. Thank you for admitting it. You are a sore loser, aren't you? I wonder why. Whatever. Um, pretty strong, I hope you know that. You're pretty strong. But that's not saying much compared to uh, everyone else, because, you know, y'all suck. Oh, you do have a life for that uh, sudden. Did not expect that, so I gotta give you props for that. Either way, one hit KO again. Pursuit, okay, do what you want, don't really care. Well, way to go, you actually inflicted damage to, um, Terex. That's, uh, new. Great plans are always interrupted. Wait, what? That's that's not right. H how are fake plan or great plans um interrupted? If they're great, then they would not be interrupted. I don't know, but I guess radical plans are always interrupted, like uh, changing or world-changing plans. I guess I don't know. Sandial, and uh, this is the last guy. Keep on doing the same thing over and over again. Go acrobatics. Are you noticing how these are all one-hit KOs? I mean, Terex, when he evolves, it's even gonna be even, it's gonna be even better. And I just hope that uh, I don't have to face Pokemon that are too quick. Because if that happens, then Terex would just suck. You will take it back. Remember that. Okay, I'll remember it. Let's see what you do about it. Um, so cold. How can I win it when I'm shivering? Oh, it's Clay and his goon of cold storage workers. I don't even know their class. That guy's a beast. He got three people. Not one, not two, three. And those people don't even complain. Good for you. You guys ain't so bad. Yep, I promise I promise. Come on and challenge my GM. Will do, buddy. Will do. Um, seven people Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You tell him. That bunch is a waste of oxygen. Ah, wow. Never, never thought I'd hear someone say that. That just shows that this guy is not ten. He's uh near sixteen. Oh, never melt ice. You attach that to an ice type Pokemon, and ice type moves uh will get stronger. Doesn't have to be an ice type, but any ice type move will become a lot stronger. And who knows? I might even use that item for a Pokemon that I might get, which might be hinting to something. I don't want to give it away, but I'm not even sure if I'm going to capture that Pokemon or not. We'll see what happens. Drift Veil music. Never gets old. Ah, uh, bike. I can't even listen to that music, the bike music. That really disappoints me. Whatever. Healing up. And that ought to do it for now. Next time on Pokemon White, we will be heading on to the Drift Veil vale Gym and taking on Clay, the Southerner, and hopefully we can uh, get our fifth gym badge. Until then, everyone.